Hey guys, today I'm going to be talking about the Gator Athletic Training Off-Season Regimen, also known as Gator. It's super important that we work in the off-season um, so that we don't have a week one where we forfeit um, and have to visit the hospital to get half our team back. Um, I want to win. I want to, honestly, I want to win titles. I want to win championships. Um, I especially want to beat Stanford. <coughs> um... So all that comes from um, determined and consistent effort through the off-season, and that's going to be through strength training and cardio. Um, there's lots of options uh, for strength. You can do John's calisthenics program that he made for us. Um, I'll share it later. Um, this is something that you can do in your hotel room on vacation. It's something that you could do in your own room or outside if you don't have equipment. Um, and... Uh, yeah, I also uh, made a weightlifting program that I'll talk about later. Um, this is if you have access to a gym. Um, and then you could also do your own program or follow you know, your coaches or some TikTok guy or ChatGPT or whatever. But honestly, um, I think to become the best rugby player that you can be, um, you should follow one of ours um, or just ask us about uh, weightlifting advice. Uh, we're here to help you guys. Um, we want us to be a winning team. Um, and we, uh, John and I are certified personal trainers. We know a lot about this stuff, uh, probably more than, you know, whatever person on YouTube shorts. So yeah, um, so that's strength. There's also going to be a cardio, um, requirement, uh, try and do 150 minutes a week. Um, I'm also going to be booting up rugby run club. Um, so yeah, that paired with some, some, uh, swimming or hiking or, you know, bike riding, something like that, um, will get you up to 150 minutes a week, or you could do your own independent 150 minutes a week of cardio. Anyways, all of this is going to be shared in a Google Drive, by the way, that you will access. Um, so here's John's calisthenics program. It has three days that can be accessed down here. I'm not sure how it looks on mobile, but that's what it looks like on PC. Um, he has notes for everything, sets, reps. Um, he also has um, instructional videos with links um, for every single movement, which uh, is really helpful. Thanks, John. Um, and then I made a weightlifting program. Um, it's kind of it's full body um, every single day. So instead of having all of your chest volume. Um, all in one day, it's split out over the week, which is um, a bit more optimal. Um, when you're doing this program, all work should be performed at um, like an 8 out of 10 difficulty or higher, where 10 out of 10 difficulty is literally like you're pushing as hard as you possibly can and you can't do any more. Um, you should be working at like 8, 9, 10 out of 10 uh, difficulty or uh, effort. Um, you should really be working hard. You're going to get out of this what you put into it. Um, so it's really up to you. Uh, how much better of a rugby player you want to be. Um, you should rest at least one and a half minutes per set for these exercises. Um, probably more on like the squats and leg presses and things like that because um, if you're if you're winded by the time you're trying to do the next set, um, you're not going to be able to perform the next set um, as best as you can. Um, the main contributor to success with any uh, strength training or uh, bodybuilding program is going to be rest, recovery, and diet. Um, if you're not eating well, if you're not sleeping well, if you're not eating enough, then you're not going to see the results that you would like to see. Um, for diet, imagine it as if um, you're building, like, like you're constructing a building, right? All of this is just a blueprint, and when you do it, it's like um, hiring construction workers for a building. But the building is not going to be built unless you give, like you order the materials. Unless you, you know, you eat your steak burritos or whatever to get your protein and your calories. You should be aiming for above 2,000 calories. Um, I mean, obviously depending on body type. Um, and enough protein to where you have one gram of protein per pound of body weight a day as like a general benchmark. So for me, I'm 225 pounds. I'd be eating 225 grams of protein a day. Um, and then, yeah, sleeping. Um, also, 
like not drinking alcohol all the time. Anyways, talk for another time. Um, if you have uh, questions for any of this, just ask me. Um, you can also just look up like form questions uh, or like um, form videos for any of these exercises. Um, you should be trying to lift with the uh, best form that you possibly can. Um, I feel like this is all easy to understand. Um, this should be a weighted barbell, by the way, for this. Um, yeah, uh, this program is a little more focused on, or actually not a little more, a lot more focused on lower body strength rather than upper body strength. Um, I mean, you know, there is enough, like 11 sets per week for tricep, 9 sets per week for bicep. That is enough. You know, you're getting like 70% of optimal uh, muscle growth. Um, but it's really geared towards lower body because, you know, in my mind, that's what's going to make you a better rugby player. And honestly, I think that my my methodology is already proven with how you guys have seen me play rugby. Um, so I think you can trust this. I think you can trust my program. Um, and I'd really like for you guys to get on it. Um, we're going to be having Rugby Run Club again. There's going to be, obviously, you run a mile every day. There's going to be minimums, tracking, and prizes. Um, for backs, the minimum is 65%. Uh, forwards is 45%. Um, prizes, um, so if you get like perfect, if you do 100%, we're going to give your ass a fancy dinner. 90% uh, people, we're going to get like a shirt or a hat or something, something cool um, where you'd like it. And then the fastest three average mile times for the forwards and the backs are going to get something. Uh, you can also, instead of a mile, do uh, like 20K steps or a hike or, you know, touch practice with somebody. Um, and just in general, your miles should be fast. All right. Thanks, guys. Appreciate it.